substantive issues you're talking about? You know? Well, mostly just encouraging. You know, uh, uh, one of you had the first uh, story I saw, you know, will they finish on time today? I'm sure if you go back in time, that story probably comes out about 10 days out every time. Mostly just reminding, particularly the freshmen, uh, at least viewing it from the governor's office, this seems to be moving pretty customary to how it does every year. We still have 10 days, uh, and both sides are talking, things are moving, so we're encouraged. We think, uh, we think that the House and Senate are, are working, are moving forward, that we're on a path uh, to bring it in for a landing and finish the session on time. I just want to encourage members to keep doing that, keep working together, uh, because it does seem, uh, from what we're seeing, that they are going in the right direction. What are you hearing on the seminal compact this year? Well, really didn't talk specifics. Um, more so just trying to be encouraged. And if, you, if you look at almost any of the issues uh, that are being negotiated, there does appear to be uh, wiggle room for both sides. So we're encouraged that, that they are moving forward and we'll continue to we're, we're anticipating, the people out here are anticipating uh, an important announcement by the governor about Seminole gambling money today. Are we, are we on the right track there? This is something... We'll just wait and see. Okay. Yeah. What are you hearing from members as far as, you know, we're talking about Seminole, other issues you're hearing about from lawmakers are saying, hey, can you get involved on this and maybe help us uh, get some resolution on this one? Uh, not so much. I mean, we're working. Both sides are talking. That's why it's encouraging. It's, you know, and we see this every year, you know, we get to this stage. This is really when the work gets done. These last 10 days. Uh, so in many respects, this is when you know the session is beginning. Right now is when the serious negotiations are taking place, and they're both working hard. And, and we feel uh, very confident that the legislature will get done. What do you make of the oil drilling proposal? So, especially as someone who represented an area with great beaches and a lot of shores. Well, we we have to look at the details of it, but I think that. The house side is going to be part of the overall energy package, which obviously has things that the governor supports. And so we haven't seen the details, uh, at least I haven't. Uh, the offshore, offshore side, of it. we'll see. But it, it, you know, plenty of time to bring it in. For me. Governor, the house's position is that the, the Senate needs to take a longer look at the at the budget, and that's why it's pushing so hard for budget reductions. Uh, saying you, you, you can't rely on federal stimulus money for too long. Do you, do you agree with that position? Well, I think they're talking. I mean, they're both talking. And really, uh, one encouraging thing is that neither side has really uh, drawn a line in the sand that's going to make it difficult. Uh, we're, we're, we're encouraged by the fact that they're talking and moving forward. And like I said, 10 days is like a lifetime as far as the session goes. And the fact that we're this far along, considering the, the, the budgetary uh, challenges, we're encouraged, and we'll, we'll keep working, and, and uh, we'll, we'll get right. But as a, as a former House member and a, and a conservative one at that, do, do you agree with that philosophy that they're, they're standing firm on, that, that there needs to be more cuts over and looking at a, at a broader range of cuts? Well, I don't know. I, I don't know. And I don't know that that, my, my view is that where we are today is not where we're going to be in 10 days. And, uh, and I think that, that they're moving forward, and that's really the most important thing, you know, to fulfill the, the constitutional obligation to pass a balanced budget. Everybody seems to be working towards that goal, and, and that's, that's good. That's okay, okay.